I'm Betsu Ramos and this is your UWW-TV News Update. Governor Tony Evers signed a bill that approved the funding to renovate two of UW-Whitewater's academic buildings, Winther and Heidi Hall, on March 6. The funds will go mainly to Winther Hall in order to improve the education received by future educators in the state of Wisconsin. Some repairs include replacing the roof, elevators, and a large amount of windows to improve the indoor daylight. Both buildings have to update accessibility restrooms for students with disabilities as well. Construction is planned to start in late 2025 and to be fully completed by late 2028. UW-Whitewater experienced the second tornado warning in a month on Monday, March 4th, causing many students and faculty to head to assigned tornado shelters. At 3.17 in the afternoon, the first tornado warning was issued for the Rock County campus. Later at 4.11 in the afternoon, Whitewater had been alerted and remained under shelter for around 30 minutes. The weather had downgraded to severe thunderstorms later on, allowing students and staff to leave their designated sheltered areas. And we'll have more updates after a quick break. We'd love to show you what it's like to be a Warhawk. Come on! <laughs> Whitewater. You belong here! During December's commencement ceremony, a group of Wisconsin educators were the first to graduate from UW-Whitewater's online degree program titled Master of Science in Education and Early Childhood Education Policy. The program launched in 2022 and was designed to give professionals the tools needed to find solutions in early childhood education systems. The program can be completed in under 15 months and includes 30 credits and an internship. Too sick to come to the dining hall? Fill out a survey to receive a sick meal kit. Once the survey has been checked over and approved, the meal can be picked up by a roommate or a friend. The meal includes an entree, various beverage options, and dining utensils. To receive a sick meal kit, the form must be submitted between 8 in the morning and 4 in the afternoon, Monday through Friday. For more updates, check us out at uwwtv.org. I'm Betsy Bear Ramos, and this has been your news update on UWW-TV.